shall declare your praise. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The angel of the Lord announced to Mary, and she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee, Blessed are thou amongst women, and bless the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord, be it done according to thy word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the Word was made flesh and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, the Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Pour forth, we beseech you, O Lord, your grace into our hearts, that we, to incarnation of Christ your Son, was made known by the message of an angel. May by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Thank you, Lord, for this wonderful day for the gift of life, for the newness of the day, for the brightness and light with which we will live during the day. Lord, we thank you for becoming our presence at this time, for being with us, for assuring us of your company, love, affection and care. Lord, we have come before you so that we can begin our day with love for you and for our neighbors. Our love for our brothers and sisters, for our near and dear ones and for everyone. Lord, we thank you for all the blessings we receive every moment. Lord, apart from my life, Especially, I pray along with my intentions for the intentions of those who need your miracle and favor at this moment. We pray for those who are sick and suffering. Lord, we pray for the intentions of each one who is present for this adoration and morning prayer, to praise you, to worship you, and to receive your favor. With devotion and total surrender, we come before you, Lord. Lord, listen to our prayers. Listen to the yearnings of our hearts and desires. We love you, Lord. We praise you. We thank you. We worship you. 
Lord, at this time we pray for the sick and the suffering, those anxious, worried, depressed about many things in this world. Pray for those who are neglected. We pray for those who are rejected. We pray for those who feel lonely and being hated by their own family members. Lord, we pray to you for the intentions of Salvador, Diana, Dominic and Savio. We pray for the intentions of Sonita Carvalho and family from Australia. We pray to you for the intentions of healing for Ingrid and family. We pray for the intentions of Donna and for the release of her son in Australia. Change the heart of the government people to release him and unite with the family. Lord, look after his survival, his day-to-day -day living a job for him. Today we pray for those who need jobs, either new jobs or those who wish to discontinue and look for another. We pray for those who are struggling in life, giving interviews from place to place, companies to companies, but not able to receive that favor. Lord, touch the lives of everyone at this time, all those who are looking for jobs. We are going to have healing, deliverance for those hurdles that come on our way to receive new job. Lord, renew our lives, renew our whole being, renew our spirit and soul. Lord, we pray to you for those couples who are waiting for the gift of child. We pray to you for those women in the hospitals for delivery. We pray for those who have complications. We pray for those women who are worried, anxious, tensed and depressed about how things will be. Lord, bless those families who are broken and have disturbances in their married life. Lord, bless those children who are disturbed, unable to study, the youth who are addicted to alcoholism, drugs, social media, and other types of worldly materialism. Lord, we pray to you for our parents who struggle day in and day out to keep the family happy. Bless those who have lots of struggles and difficulties. Lord, we pray to you for the aged senior members in our homes, especially those who are sick and suffering on the deathbed, those who are fractured, injured, those who need your company because they feel lonely, being hated. Lord, we pray to you for all those who consider us enemies and hate us. Lord, we pray for those who hate Christians. We pray for all our brothers and sisters of all religions, castes, that we all unite and remain together. We pray for Israel, Palestine and the whole of Middle East, Russia and Ukraine and Manipur, that there may be true peace and genuine love for each other. Lord, the King of Kings, we praise you, we worship you, we depend on your mercy and compassion. Let us take the hymn on page 286, hymn N9. 
Give me joy in my heart, keep me praising. Give me joy in my heart, I pray. Give me joy in my heart, keep me praising. Keep me praising till the end of day. Sing Hosanna, sing Hosanna. Sing Hosanna to the King of Kings. Come on and sing Hosanna. Sing Hosanna. Sing Hosanna to the King. Give me oil in my lamp. Keep me burning. Give me oil in my lamp. I pray. Give me oil in my lamp, keep me burning, keep me burning till the end of day. Sing Hosanna, sing Hosanna, sing Hosanna to the King of Kings. Come on, let's sing Hosanna, sing Hosanna. Sing Hosanna to the King. Give me love in my work, keep me serving. Give me love in my work, I pray. Give me love in my work, keep me serving. Keep me serving till the end of day. Sing Hosanna. Sing Hosanna, sing Hosanna to the King of Kings. Come on, let's sing Hosanna, sing Hosanna, sing Hosanna to the King. Dear brothers and sisters, let us take Psalm eighty-five. A poor man's prayer in time of trouble. Let us pray very earnestly for those who need God's help at this moment, for God's favor and miracle. The antiphon: Give joy to your servant, Lord, for to you I lift up my soul. Turn your ear, O Lord, and give answer, for I am poor and needy. Preserve my life, for I am faithful. Save the servant who trusts in you. You are my God. Have mercy on me, Lord, for I cry to you all the day long. Give joy to your servant, O Lord, for to you I lift up my soul. O Lord, you are good and forgiving. Full of love to all who call, give heed, O Lord, to my prayer, and attend to the sound of my voice. In the day of distress, I will call, and surely you will reply. Among the gods, there is none like you, O Lord, nor work to compare with yours. All the nations shall come to adore you and glorify your name, O Lord, for you are great and do marvelous deeds. You who alone are God, show me, Lord, your way, so that I may walk in your truth. Guide my heart, heart to fear your name. I will praise you, Lord, my God, with all my heart, and glorify your name for ever. For your love to me has been great; you have saved me from the depths of the grave. The proud have risen against me; ruthless men seek my life. To you they pay no heed, but you, God of mercy and compassion, slow to anger, O Lord, abounding in love and truth, turn and take pity on me. O give your strength to your servant and save your handmaid's son. Show me a sign of your favor that my foes may see to their shame, that you console me and give me your help. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Give joy to your servant, Lord, 
for to you I lift up my soul. Dear brothers and sisters, let us take the scripture reading from Job chapter 1 verse 21, chapter 2 verse 10. Naked I came from my mother's womb, and naked shall I return. The Lord gave, and the Lord has taken away. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Shall we receive good at the hand of God, and shall we not receive evil? The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Dear brothers and sisters, let us pause for some time and pray for those who need job, those who have financial difficulties, those who need at this time God's care, love, those who need serenity, tranquility and peace, those who have difficulty for their daily earning, survival. And we remember the poor and the needy. Let us raise our hands in praises to God and in earnest request for the prayers that we make. I come to you at this moment, my Lord and my God, with the very prayer Jabez prayed in First Chronicles chapter 4, verses 9 and 10. And you heard him and blessed him. Take the burden of my past and bless me right now. Refresh and renew my life, O Lord, so that I may serve you effectively. Let your powerful presence be upon me always to strengthen protect and shield me from every evil so that none will cause me pain or suffering. Lord Jesus, at this time I pray to you to grant me a job for my survival. Bless me with wisdom and knowledge, especially to give my interviews properly. Fill me with your spirit, Lord, and genuine love for you so that I may live in this world, not just for the survival in materialism, but with the spiritual love for you, to save my soul. We make this prayer through Christ our Lord, through Mary our Mother, through angels and all the saints. Amen. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Hallelujah, 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 thank you, Jesus, thank you, Spirit of God, thank you, Abba Father, thank you, Mama Mary, thank you, all the angels and saints, thank you, Jesus, praise you, Jesus, worship you, Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Let us pray. Lord God, in your wisdom you created us. By your providence you rule us. Penetrate our inmost being with your holy light so that our way of life may always be one of faithful service to you. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Dear brothers and sisters, let us sincerely pray as the choir sings the hymn of benediction.
May Almighty God bless us with the favors, graces, and blessings we need.